Guys, do you suffer from frizzy fringes and bangs? You know, it looks okay on some people, but if you're not feeling it, do not fear. You do not have to suffer in silence because I have an answer for you. Just take some water and some bobby pins, mine are in this old candle jar. Saturate your hair, get it nice and wet. Don't need it sopping wet, but wet enough to work with. And then just take some hair away and just leave the bit here that you're working with. And all we're doing is finding the natural curl pattern of our hair. And you just need to sort of just comb your hair out a bit and just see which way it's curling and then wrap it around your finger and then bobby pin it in place. It's so easy. And you just wrap it around. And the best way I find to see what the natural curl pattern of that piece is is to just start wrapping and see if it flicks back another way so you can see the curl pattern of this piece I know it's going a certain direction so I can just sort of just twist it a bit and just get that nice and defined and then start wrapping it around my finger and then I will just clip that in place I'm not using any gels any creams I'm not even using any hairspray with this, I'm just bobby pinging it in place. And like this part as well, you just flick it one way, see if it tries to go back another way, because it wasn't really clear which way that one was going to go. But I can see now it's going to go that way, so I start wrapping it that way around my finger. And when you're wrapping it around the natural curl pattern, it's really going to hold in place so well. You won't even need any hairspray or anything, because really you are just sort of accentuating the natural curl pattern of your hair. So that piece was pretty obvious which way it was going to go, so I just went and wrapped that one around. And you're going to do that with as many pieces of hair as you want to. I'm just done the whole front of my hair just to show you for this video and then just finish getting ready finish putting on your makeup you can read some recipes like I'm doing here or you can find what you're gonna make for dinner apparently I'm making granola bars for dinner <laughs> you can paint your nails like I'm doing here, I'm using a barium texture sparkle thing, it's quite nice. Or you can just contemplate life, just while you're waiting for that to dry and then you can come back and take those out but they do have to be completely dry when you take them out otherwise they won't really stay and they won't be as springy and defined. So just make sure they're as dry as you can before you take them out. You can take a hairdryer to them, but if you don't want to use any heat, then just let them dry naturally. You can even sleep with them in overnight. But if you only just realised your hair was frizzy in the morning, then the best thing to do is do it first thing and then finish getting ready and then take them out just before you leave through the door. So I'm just taking them all out. They won't be perfect, but they will be defined and springy, which is what we want. So take them all out and it doesn't really matter if they're all as the same length because since when was curly hair ever the same length you can sort of just bounce it up a bit, arrange it how you want to and that is the final look. It was so easy. So let me know what you think of that. And guys, yes, that is the same technique that I use on some pieces of hair when I do my wash and go as well if I have time. So thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment and subscribe. Bye. Won't you stay with me?